भारतीय जनता पार्टी हरियाणा के अंदर तीसरी बार प्रचंड बहुमत से वो आई है इन अ सरप्राइजिंग ट्विस्ट दैट डिफाइड मोस्ट एग्जिट पोल्स द बीजेपी हैज क्लेम्ड इट्स थर्ड स्टेट विन इन हरियाणा असेंबली इलेक्शन grabbing 48 seats and setting a new record over its 2014 and 2019 performances. So how did the BJP pull off this impressive victory? Let's dive into the details. The BJP's success really comes down to smart election management and some effective social engineering. By focusing on strategic regions across Haryana, they not only secured their core base but also managed to broaden their appeal. Haryana is often divided into different belts each with unique voting dynamics. Here's a quick snapshot of how the BJP performed across these regions. In the GT Road belt, traditionally a BJP stronghold, they backed 14 seats here, slightly better than the 2019 tally. Bagad belt. In this jhar dominated area, the BJP held its ground with 8 seats repeating their previous performance. Deshwal belt, known for leaning towards Congress, the BJP managed to double its count from 2 to 4 seats, making key gains. In the Ahirwal belt, the BJP dominated this Yadav majority region, winning 10 out of 11 seats. While the BJP made inroads in the Bangad and Brij belts, they couldn't secure any seats in the Muslim majority Mewad region. Many thought the election would be all about the Jat versus non-Jat divide, but the results tell a more complex story. The BJP won 6 out of 14 key seats where both they and Congress fielded Jat candidates. plus they captured new ground in other jhar dominated areas showing that caste wasn't the only factor in play the bjp's win is even more noteworthy given their recent setbacks in the 2024 lok sabha elections by mending fences and strengthening their social coalition including upper caste other backward classes and scheduled castes they managed to bounce back with a strong vote share of nearly 40% Now the real challenge will be delivering on big promises like job creation and support for farmers. On the other side, the Congress led by Bhupinder Singh Hooda couldn't turn the tide. While they did see some success in SC dominated areas, internal conflicts and a lack of coordination proved costly. Their failure to form alliances, particularly with AAP, weakened their chances in this head-to-head -head with BJP. If you like this video, don't forget to subscribe to Business Standard for more such insightful content.